What is this life if full of care we have no time to stand and stare or even explore for that matter when was the last time you came up here to the mountains well for the first 10 years as an automotive journalist i've done the himalayan rally 3 times driven up here 5 6 times but past 6 7 years not even once wow. the last time i was here must have been what 4 years ago well, finally, we are here in Manali. We've taken time out to come to Manali. We've got all the time in the world. There are no pressures of time, doing web stories for that matter. <laughs> Any ideas? You're looking at the map. Any ideas where should we head? The Manali Leh Highway would have been an obvious choice. But that is a road that has been sanitized. No longer does it promise adventure like it used to. So instead, we narrowed in on trail that connects Lahore to the Zanskar Valley. It is called Shingola and was part of the old silk route that people would cross on foot to trade goods like salt and sapphires. The mountains are temperamental and we needed someone who knew them well. Meet Suresh Rana, 11-time Raid the Himalaya winner and a man who knows these parts like nobody else. From Manali, the first of the high altitude passes we had to cross was Rotang. At 13,000 feet, we drove through the biting cold and the Volkswagen Tiguan that we had driven all the way from Pune was getting a primer for the adventure ahead. It is harsh at the top of Rotang and to think Shingola is going to be even harsher. We had no idea what lay ahead. The nerves were kicking in, but nerves are good. They keep you alive. The Lahol Valley. It's majestic. Mountains larger than I had ever imagined. Ice cold rivers formed from melting glaciers and views that would last us a lifetime. Every corner we came around would have vistas more spectacular than the last one. This place it really puts things into perspective. It's in front of mountains like these that I realized how small and how insignificant we really are. Today, if you want to drive from Manali to the Zanskar Valley, Google Maps will take you on a route via Leh and Kargil that takes two full days. The old trekking route via Shingola doesn't even show up on Google. But if you motor down it, you can reduce the traveling to less than a day. You can see why this route is significant. We passed Keelong, then Jispa, and finally turned off the main highway at the village of Darcha. Shingola. We knew we had reached the start of the climb when the road disappeared. The Tiguan has all-wheel drive and a special off-road drive mode which helped on the steep, rutted hairpins. The climb was tough and it only got tougher the higher up we went. Shingola was as fearsome as we imagined. Just when we thought the worst was done, we found snow. Switched to snow mode and the Tiguan made steady progress up the mountain. Shingola threw everything it could at us. Water crossings, heavy snow, 100 foot drops into a gorge. And if the mountains can't break your car, they will try to break your spirit. The temperature was plummeting and the air got thinner, but we dug deep and pushed on.
and this is the Shinkola Pass. What is it? 16,580 16, feet. 16, feet. Uh, can you imagine back in the day? This was the old silk route. So silk used to come down from China on this route. Sapphires from the mines in the Zanskar Valley, salt from God knows where, and they used to come down this route and bring it down to Lahore and then to Himachal. Can you imagine even tracing this route back in the day? Unbelievable. I mean, right now at least there's a rough trail of some sort. I don't even know what existed back then. And it's so cold, it's so harsh, it is spectacularly beautiful, but even spectacularly, even more spectacularly inhospitable and harsh. <laughs> That's the thing about the mountains. No matter where you look, you will find adventure. We came out here to get away from the monotony of the daily grind and Shingola put us so far out of our comfort zone. But that is exactly where the magic happens. Subscribe to Evo India and let us know what you think about this video in the comments.